Wonderful people, viewers and subscribers, you're welcome back again. I want to quickly chip in the position of the former president of Nigeria. Good luck, Ebele, Jonathan. In non finally speak on the wudu of Ike and their declaration as as today. I know the mood of the country generally is because of the issues bordering on the elections. So some people are happy, some people are sad, so all kinds of sentiments and feelings. Uh, by this time, then of course already I've considered the visit to the president. So that was completely over. And I knew why I considered the visit, because I was more interested in the country than myself. The problem we have is the electoral management by the INEC and the security. And I used to give an example. If two soccer teams are playing, and the referee decide to look the other way. They will enjoy themselves. People are contesting for elections. Should expect that it's like it's okay. Everybody wants to win. And, and you must not allow it. The electoral management bodies are share more than sixty percent of the blame. Because if they do their work well, the politicians will have no choice than to follow the rules they the security and the courts i believe one day we'll get there but i feel sad now that uh, our electoral process is still wobbling so we have migrated from candidate to beaver which is a superior technology why do we still have problem manual voting we have problems in this country electronic we have so where is the problem coming from is the independent uh, the electoral management board design like in this case and they has to sit up so that they will not throw this country into conflagration one day. And people must be serious. And Nike must sit up. We should commission one of these internationally uh, known IT companies. They will want to protect their image and allow them to build a system for us and also manage it during our elections. Good. In as much as Jonathan trying to be politically correct, making no um, step on anybody told. In the American soft law, if you stand critically said in a plain language, I like did wuru wuru and they pronounce somebody that did not win the winner. That is just it. Because you know, every time he say we go to play a match and the referee go look the other side, opponent go. They call a legal goal. Or perhaps at the center of the game, the free itself. Where on this position be I neck? Go shift go post from where in be to another place when he be say that that place where the opponent they score goal anyhow. My people, now the situation where would they be say be this? That is the situation of Nigeria. And Jonathan has spelled it out clearly. And if this thing continues like this, and of which it is going to get worse, if this illegitimate government is allowed or sustained, it is going to get worse. To the point where it is only either the Supreme Court or the INEC or the armed security officers and the touts, plus including touts, because this time touts have gained a very prestigious position talking about the romance between Tinibu and uh, um, Asari Dokubo, uh, MC Oluomo, and the rest of them. And we're no longer talking about Shetima's involvement with the one happening in the North. <laughs> it is going to, you know, pad up. And these will be the four factors that will be determining political leaders in this country. And you know what, it, what that means. Now share this video. Drop your comment on the comment section and keep hitting it hard we, because we keep speaking up that is the way to raise the consciousness of nigerians to know say that there is danger that is about to consume every nigerian irrespective of where you're coming from or your religion or even your indigenous identity whether you are a biafran whether you're a duduwa whether you are a this danger will consume everyone without exception so it is good for all as a people Pick up and rise up to end this man.